Hey guys, welcome back to another Ganchi Plans. Uh, today we are doing a monthly plan with me. It's August 2022, or at least it will be in a couple of days. Um, August 1st is my return to work date after maternity leave. And so things are switching up and changing around. And I, um, I'm, I guess, trying to prepare for it as best I can. I just got this new washi tape from Comic-Con from a shop called Le Petit Telephone. Um, and it's pretty cute. It's got these like tropical fruits on it. And so that's what I've been using this week um, to sort of keep me company. And I think that's what I'm going to inspire my monthly um, color scheme off of. So I've got sort of a conglomeration of oranges and yellows. Um, and we're going to kind of get started. I'm going to open up my planner here, sort of off camera to my future log. So I can see what I'm doing, what I will be doing. Um, and I'm going to give you a tour of what I'm using. So this is the freebie um, monthly dashboard available at gangiplans.com slash shop. Just um, click on freebies and you'll be able to find it. Um, I decided to go for a um, sort of hybrid, two different inserts, two different months on one page. <clears throat> this is the left half of insert 20, um, but I printed it on the right. And then this is um, the month on one page insert 62. So I'm going to try to use these two together. I just kind of wanted something a little bit different uh, since I'm going to be doing something a little bit different this month. <clears throat> uh, it's Oh, and then on the back is insert 18 which is, uh, I use this for tracking breast milk. It's probably not enough space for that because I usually use like one of these rows per day. Um, so I'm not sure whether I'll use it for that or not, but I've been printing it on the back of my monthly because I may as well. Um, the toner is negligible, you know, to just have something there. Uh, and I have not been using it, but maybe I will. And then these are my weeklies that I printed out. I'm going way back to basics. This is insert two. This is the one that started it all. This is like the um, the design idea that I had that made me think that I could I could make my own inserts. So here we are. Um, it's a split weekly, so it's got Monday through Friday on one side and then the weekend on the other side. Now that I'm going back to the um, to work and I'm going to have like that work week, uh, I figured I would do that and have it sort of split that way. So. It's got sort of a habit tracker, which I kind of use as a an Alistair weekly task list. And then there's room for things on every day of the week and then lots of room on the weekends. So I just printed out a bunch of those to use since I am um, I'm out of weeklies. I've just been like using them until I'm out of them and then print printing a new one um, lately. So I haven't been doing anything to this dashboard. Um, you could obviously decorate it because it's very minimalist, but I just sort of leave it like this and open up and take a look here. Um, let's see where I can have room to put some of this washi tape to get us started. I think, here we go. Here's a Carl's Jr. script gift card. And I will put this along at the bottom here. And use the card to cut. Here we go. Yeah. All right. I was doing so well, and then I um with my weeklies, I was putting some of my weeklies, and then I like kind of messed it up, and it got off off straight. I don't know. So it doesn't really make sense. So that's pretty. Um, I think I might put some up along here too, actually, because I usually don't have that many events. I don't think I have that many events. There are a lot of birthdays in our family in August. It's my husband's, uh, both of his parents and their anniversary, but they usually like do a combo thing since it's also close together. Um, and that'll just be like, you know, a dinner or something. Nothing extravagant, I don't think. All right, and then I guess we got to decide on some, uh, what's it called? Colors and stuff. Um, 
So I'm going to go for the red along the top here. Now in theory this would be the spot where you write the, the month. But I think that actually is going to be on this side. Because this little box here is for the mini calendar, because this is a month on one page. So that way I will actually have this, um, you know, so I could, it's just quick and easy to see weeks this way. So the first is a Monday. And if I don't label it, I usually do Sunday start, because, you know, grew up with it. Uh, I'm just going to count to. 31 real quick. Okay. Not too bad. Uh, then goals. Oh, let's see. I'm going to use the yellow for these headers. Um, one major goal will be planning our two year old's birthday which is mid-September. So let me see, do I put that in? Bridget's birthday. I feel like she deserves something because <laughs> her, uh, our four-year-old has been getting all of the toys and attention lately. Um, the two-year-old needs some presents, at least. Um, I'll just go ahead and highlight the weekends here. And I guess I'll just use black and fill in the days of the week. Because the next real thing is to pull out the future log and, and do some actual planning. Um, if there's a second goal, I will figure it out and add it here. August. Okay, first day of school is the 22nd. I'll put that here. First day of TK. Then, yeah, obviously I'm going back to work on the first. I'm not even going to put that here. Um, oh, yeah, I need to get... Uh, we have a cousin's birthday party, also turning four. That's all that's on my future log here. So then the next thing in here, which I'm not going to show you on camera, is the school calendar, which I have just sort of printed out and folded up. I've sort of showed that a little bit in um, in previous flip throughs. So let's see. Noon dismissal is on the first day and then that Friday. I don't know if that matters. I'll just put it over here. If I get to work from home on either of those days, I might go and um, be there for pickup, but she's still going to be going to the babysitter after. And then the thing I needed to know about was meet the teacher is on the 18th. I'll put that here because it's an event. I don't know. Meet the teacher from five to seven. I don't, we don't have to be there for two hours, um, but it's, you know, open house night before school starts. So we drop off all the supplies and meet the teacher. Yeah. Next I'm looking at this recurring tasks list or this last time done type log. I'm going to see, yeah, oh, I needed to do that this week, so I haven't added that yet. Toothbrushes, um, no, razor, 
When did I do the razor? Oh, I have it. Okay. I'll put like tasks on this side. So change razors. Do that once a month. Sheets, I still need to do this week. Um, oh, okay, I did. Did those charcoal bags last week? When was that? Um, I did that last week. I don't think I marked off which day though. So it probably doesn't matter, but it's probably Tuesday, Monday? I'd say Monday, the 18th. So I'll put here that I did it in July 18th, which means it's due August 18th. They're just these little like air freshening bags that you're supposed to do um, like once a month you're supposed to throw them out in the sun to like refresh them. I don't know. And then Twitch was yesterday, no, 25th. Alright, let's do Twitch on the 25th. That's uh, renewing a Prime subscription which has to be done manually. And then car insurance. No, car insurance is in October. All right. Then we don't have any library books checked out right now, actually. I'm going to look here at my birthdays and anniversaries list. And as you see, there are several. So I'm going to go ahead and fill those in over on this side because it's just sort of informational when the actual birthday is. Um, and then if there's a party or a dinner or whatever, that'll go on this side, I think. Um, there's six, so that's... Um, I'll just put V in. That, that means something. Uh, that's Maria's birthday, and then their anniversary is also this month, so we'll put S in, because I know that doesn't mean my parents, it means my brother, because I know when my parents' anniversary is. Alright, so that's birthdays and anniversaries, and then I think that's the last section in my future log. I have things that, you know, are ongoing projects, like I said, this one, some other things that I, I really need to go through and like do a brain dump and move things around in my planner and decide what my current projects are. Um, this last week, I'm just sort of getting, well, honestly, I'm coming back down from Comic-Con and trying to relax a little bit um, and just sort of enjoy it. Um, and then I will decide what things I can sort of reasonably fit into my schedule. Once I know what work is going to be like, we're, they switched, or at least they told me they were going to be switching to a new software while I was gone. And so I don't know how stressful that's going to be for me, whether I'm going to have the bandwidth to get stuff done in the evenings. I don't know whether I'm going to be able to continue doing the split um, working from home so that I could get some, you know, reorganization or chores or cleaning done during my breaks. Um, so a lot of the things in this month are up in the air. Okay. All right. Will you help me? I'm still filming. You shaking there? Yep, I am. Oof. All right, Bridgie, what was I talking about? Um, um, cheez -Its? cheez -Its? I was talking about Cheez-Its. Okay. Well, let me just take a moment to show you some cool stickers that I got at Comic-Con. These are from BeCute.com with a K. <laughs> um, and I was super surprised. Oh, these are the little freebie postcards. Um, I was super surprised to see legitimate, like, Bujo stickers, like planner stickers at Comic-Con, um, which is something I was, like, have been hoping for for so long. Um... So I'm excited to use these. And I gotta warn you, I, uh, I'm feeling this weird uh, little pull towards moving into, back into a traveler's notebook. 
it's been a long time, but I'm thinking about that as sort of a project. So, um, that might be my secondary goal or my second goal here for the month. If, uh, that keeps niggling at my brain, then I might start working on that. Um, and then I've got space here for additional tasks that will come up that are undated and then things for next month, things that are notes for this month. I don't know. Um, uh, but there you go. That's basically, there it is. And, uh, I think, I think we're done. I think we're wrapped up, ready to go. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, don't forget to subscribe. I post videos every, oh, you know what I did forget? I post videos every Thursday of my planner stuff. Uh, so don't forget to subscribe while I chat and pull out the, let's see, what is it? August. Why is, oh, I know why August isn't here. Okay. I know why August isn't here. That's fine. There we go. Okay. Bridgie, you want to say bye-bye? Bye-bye.